Hi friends. You know, a viable option in today's market would be a adjustable rate mortgage. Adjustable rate mortgages in the past have not had much of a difference on rate between the 30 year fixed rate and then the adjustable rate mortgage. But the way the market is right now, there's starting to be more spread between those to the point of a 30 year mortgage we just priced out for a client was 4.875% interest rate, but yet a 10 year adjustable rate mortgage was at 4.375. So a half a percent difference in interest rate, which is pretty significant when you're starting to see the purchase prices drive up faster. We priced out this loan here at a $500,000 purchase, putting 10% down, 4.375% on what we call a 10-6 arm, meaning it's fixed for 10 years, and then it will start to adjust every six months thereafter. Now there are caps and margins and everything else that you're working with within the adjustable rate mortgage, but there's safeties in place for that. The other aspect is that most clients are not going to keep their mortgage for more than 10 years. So if you want more information on how the adjustable rate mortgage works specifically, let me know. I'm happy to, to do that. But for this, we're just looking at the strategy between an adjustable rate mortgage and a 30 year fixed. Now the savings between the two, is $134 a month. What I wanted to show you was, you can either take that $134 a month and bank that, or you can take that $134 a month and invest it into a separate side account. I have it at a 8% interest rate going up over time over the next 10 years. And that grows to about $25,000 in that account. Or you could put that $134 a month and put it back into your mortgage, paying your mortgage down faster. And as we look at paying your mortgage down faster, that can save you roughly $20,000. If we look at this on a 30 year fixed rate mortgage over a 10 year span, you will have a net worth of roughly 449,795. If we look at it on a 10 one arm, your net worth would be roughly 455,491. If we show it with the investment strategy, and you're taking the $134 a month and investing that in a separate side account, making an 8% return, which would be an average return. We'd be looking at a total net worth of roughly 480,127. And then if we look at taking it and paying your mortgage down faster, you would actually have a net worth of roughly 475,717. So really the answer here is that by taking this savings, you can either create an account that has $25,000 worth of savings in it, or you can pay your mortgage down faster by about $20,000 over the period of time. Thus, the 30 year fixed might start to be an outdated loan compared to a 10-6 arm might be a more viable option or a wiser option to create wealth faster. Now, each loan is different. Each strategy is different. We're not looking specifically at rate as much as we are strategy and what makes the most sense for you as well as suitability. We want to make sure that whatever type of loan that we do is suitable to your financial situation. Make sure that it's also suitable and viable to you in the strategies that you have place and that it doesn't mess anything up in essence. So I hope that you found this valuable. If you have, please like our YouTube channel. If you have any questions, we're here to help in any way that we can. Please reach out. We're happy to help. Thanks. Have a great day.